Hello everyone, thank you for giving us your valuable time for the demo. Uh, now we will go through the administrative modules of scientific study. We have lots of features in administration module which will help a school admin and school management to run the school very efficiently. For example, uh, you can automate all the tasks for the for the for a school admin. You can automate lots of tasks that you need to do on daily basis. For example, sending fee alerts or uh, taking attendance or uh, sending birthday wishes or any kind of news and notice events, so any kind of alerts and notifications. So there are tons of things that you can do automate to save time and money of your school. So let's go one by one. We have a student where we can manage all the students of a school. We can keep the complete details of a students. Leave management where we can manage the leaves of a staff. Then uh, staff management. The staff management is where you are going to manage the staff of your school. Then the inquiry management, attendance staff, gate pass, download, document, library module, help desk, hostel, transport, team, post jobs, calendar. There are so many things that you can do. Uh, with uh, these modules so now let's uh, start with the a student module first of all you have to log in as a school admin then go to the administration here you can also <coughs> search student go to the student module this is a one complete now one stop for managing students for everything so here this will give you an option to display all students in one snapshot for example, if I want to see the students of class 5A, click select 5A and click on search. Here you go. So this is the list of all students of class 5A. Now you can edit your students, you can update the students, you can print the details of the students. And if you want to take a notes about this student, this is a very interesting feature. This notes is uh, seen across the board by staff, by teacher, and the context of notes can be changed as per the teaching staff or as per the non-teaching staff now let's click on the edit a student this is a complete details of a student so where you can have your sibling father details mother details present address permanent address all kind of information is here student bank details previous school details student document details all the photos all information is all here and now again go back to the main module of a student if you want to search a student you can search a student here also you can find the class summary this is a very interesting module of scientific study here is a complete snapshot of all classes and a gender ratio new admissions old admissions all ratio you can find here for example this is the list of all classes for example take uh, class 6 uh, class 7 7 has 6 students. If you click on 7 students, it will tell you that which sections has how many number of students. Class 7A has 3 students. Class 7B has 3 students. And you can see the list of students. And here you can see that how many new admissions, how many old students, how many uh, female, how many males. So you can find the ratio of demographic ratio of your class. And now here you can see complete report of students there are so many reports that you can uh, that you can use to give uh, reports to the management and the government and now here is the certificates for example if you want to generate his character certificate fee certificate admit certificate or participation certificate you can simply click here and for example i'm doing class 5a class 5a name of a student is this and generate so this will generate the character certificate of this student same way you can generate the id card same way you can generate the fee certificate and other other admit card and other certificates tc you can generate the tc here uh, for example i click on uh, a class then again i do the same thing class 5a uh, select the sub the students and go once you go the system is very smart it will immediately prompt you the details of the students and it will, it will immediately display that if any book has been issued to this student from library and if this student has any fee due so see all fee dues are uh, blank here so that means the student has to either pay the fee or 
as a school admin you have to nullify the fee so what you have to do nullify fee uh, you have to select all the fee structure fee installment then you say nullify you have to give the address that this student is leaving our school so we don't need to keep this student active and then save once you nullify the fee then you can simply say generate tc when you click on generate tc it will simply generate the tc as per your school and you can the save draft or you can take the printout or you can share with the students now let's go back to the main module of student inactive if you want to make a student inactive or active you can do from here if you want to attach a sibling you can do attach sibling from here the system as i told you that our whole objective is to give a very comfortable and flexible system to the school so if you want to find a uh, possible sibling you can find the list of all possible siblings here also and now upgrade so when the academic class when the academic class changes then you can upgrade the student from one academic session to another academic session from old class to the new class this is a change academics if you want to change the status of a student if you want to change the class of a student if you want to change the section of a student and you can update the students in detail in case if you have a biometrics machine in your school you can update the biometrics details of a student here so there are lots of things that you can do for the students as you can see there are more than 20 modules that there are more than 20 30 features that you can use for the student now in administration module let's go to the staff <clears throat> here a staff module here is the list of all staff details this is the detail this is the credential if you want to send credential it's all here if you want to edit the staff details it's all here now go back this is the staff module there are lots of things that you can do here but uh, let's keep this as a simple leave management uh, this is the leave type leave allocation leave approvals leave settings leave changes history leave settings you can do manage all the masters details of leave here then you can do direct uh, leave in case if you want to apply for a staff on behalf of him you can apply direct leave here or if you you as a teacher or a staff if you want to request a leave here you can request a leave here teachers also get the same facility and in case if all teachers applies for the leave as a school admin or as a school leave approver you can find all leaves here and then in case if you have to do the in case if you have to adjust the leave you can adjust the leave here also you have to select the staff after selecting a staff you can adjust the leave here now this is a, there is a uh, there is a one rule sandwich rule that you can uh, uh, lots of school they have sandwich rule if you want to apply the sandwich rule sandwich leave rule you can apply from here and for leave model these are the modules these are the reports one two three almost 15 reports uh, 12 to 15 reports that we have in the leave module so if you want to see the staff on leave today if you want to see uh, the report staff wise leave report you can see all here so now <clears throat> Uh, let's go through the attendance of students. This is very interesting module because you can take attendance of a student through the biometrics, through the phone app, through the uh, web and also through the QR attendance. So now let's take attendance of a student. Select the class. First of all, you have to select the class here. After selecting class, what you have to do, mark all present and all students which are absent, you can simply say a student absent and then say save. And this way you can save the attendance of the students you can get the attendance of a student from the biometrics and phone app and also from here there are lots of ways that you can take attendance of a student this is these are the reports of attendance today's attendance then register view these are the reports of attendance and now let's go back to the administration module attendance for the staff so attendance for the staff is also very easy and very comfortable for you but it's very complex for us in, on behind so you can take the attendance of a staff simply do same thing mark all present or mark all absent or mark half day mark all present and then whoever is absent you can mark as absent if someone is on half day you can do half day if someone is on leave you can do on leave but remember 
if a teacher or a staff is on leave it will come automatically here you don't have to do anything this is the reason of the leave and then at last you can simply do save and this is the snapshot of today's attendance present 99 uh, holiday uh, sorry half day one absent two leave one save uh, you have to select all the staffs before you take the attendance and now these are the register view of the staff attendance and these are the reports day wise staff uh, if you want to see day wise the staff attendance report you can click here if you want to see a staff wise attendance report you have to select the staff simply select the staff and it will it will give you the present absent half day based on uh, one selected staff and based on the month if you want to see month wise attendance report simply select the month and it will give you the month wise attendance report of all staff so there are tons of things that you can do now let's go to the administration model uh, inquiry model so inquiry model uh, we provide a very good feature of QR management so what you can do you can uh, uh, you can copy and paste a QR code that we will give to you any visitors comes to your school he has to scan the QR code and whichever QR whichever uh, visitors inquires they will come in this place in your listing so this is an automated system if any visitors comes from the gate it will simply come here now now go to the administration module and there is a transport module then there is a survey there is a help tax help tax is a very interesting model so if you have a big count of students in your school then how you're going to manage those students so what we what what we, we can do we can simply say that we simply provide this public page to the students where students can get user id and password request for login details website login details they can contact you uh, they can uh, contact you for a reason for example if they want to contact you for the transport online fee online exam issue or any other issue so this is a place for the students and parents in case if they want to contact the school so you don't have get so many hassles everything is online visitor inquiry give feedback online fee payment get transfer certificate and everything will come in this listing for example if i'm going this december do all the help desk stickers created by students will come here and now go back to the administration module here download download module is a place where you can download all the data of all academic sessions so we are giving you a complete freedom of downloading data any point of time so you don't have to ask us simply download the data from here there are so many ways you can download the data now let's go back to the administration uh, this is the document module this is the library module library model in case if you want to set up the library module in your school simply go to the library model it will display all books of library you can issue a book you can return a book you can add a book you can purchase a book you can uh, uh, you can set up the complete library virtual library uh, self label this is the this is the structure of my library where you can issue the big uh, issue the books or return the books this is a system to issue and return the book if you want we can attach your library with the scanner also now let's go back to the other module in administration uh, this is a team transport survey staff post jobs post jobs can be integrated on your website so you don't have to worry any applicants who applies for the jobs they can come here for example applicants if i want to see all applicants see all applicants are here these applicants can come from the uh, your website and you can integrate the job openings on your website so now let's go back to the administration module here again alumni summary and transport is a very good system you can also integrate your gps and if you if you don't want to spend money you can simply use our phone app to track the location of bus this is the masters of uh, uh, this is the masters of uh, transport module and see the good thing is we also provide a system in case if you have a document related with the transport we can give you 
the dates when these documents will expire so you can uh, you can simply help yourself to get these documents in